the athletic endeavor, I can tell you that there is, that is something special in us. That is one of the few times when the animal and the spirit combine to make something beautiful. Amazing, you know what I mean? Something powerful. That's, that's the only time. You know, when that guy does a full stretched out one hand catch, everyone knows how rare that that is. And that's not a fucking accident. Okay, that's something that receivers dream about doing every game. You know what I mean? And uh, when the time comes, some people can do it. And it's an amazing thing to see. You know what I mean? Um, A hole in one. Um, you know, it's perfect game. Bowl a perfect game, pitch a perfect game. That guy that is running at top fucking speed, I mean top speed, quartering away from a ball that he has seen come this direction a thousand times in his life. And he's going to meet that ball over there. And he's running full speed at the fucking wall, but he knows where that ball is going to be. And at the last second, he turns his head around, reaches out, fully extended, clunk, and catches the ball, okay? All of us outfielders, we dream about that shit, okay? So the athletic endeavor, this is why I like, I enjoy, I don't, I, I, I don't like sports because I was f- forced to play sports all my life. And there's a time when you can do sports, and there's a time when you can't fucking do sports, okay? And after I got hurt, um... Yeah, and then, of course, I had to take up golf for 25 years. Uh, Fortunately, I always had a very smooth and easy swing, a nice gravity-fed swing, and um, I never really hurt my back. Um, I had a parabolic swing instead of a circular swing from the top, so I was kind of swinging down and under my chin this direction. And so I wasn't putting as much turning torque on my body, which worked for nice drives, by the way. But there comes a time when you can no longer do sports where that, that catch or that run or that whatever it is isn't going to happen anymore because you've, your body's just not capable any longer, even though the, the animal uh, still wants to give it a shot, right? <laughs> the smart part of you, the spiritual part of you says, well, we'll leave that for someone else. That's why, that's why I appreciate sports. I like watching the athletic endeavor. Each person playing his part in a team, that's very satisfying. Watching everyone cooperate, and when everyone does something right, there's, there's, everyone's covered. This guy's got nowhere to pass. You know what I mean? I mean, when you, when you see the... the how everything play out. It's very satisfying for me. Uh, pole vaulting, right? Pole vaulting. Uh, long jump. Yeah. Javelin. <laughs> Archery. A lot of sports that I played, a lot of sports that I liked. Uh, but I was always a, a little skinny kid. I was always fast. That was it. I was fast. I could catch a ball. I could throw a ball. But football, stuff like that, I was always just the lightest, skinniest kid. You know what I mean? All the way up until I was, jeez, uh, 40, 45, I guess, when I was 45. Uh, when I was 40, I was still wearing size uh, 28 pants. I won't tell you what it is now. <laughs> yeah, the sporting endeavor, both for, for men and for women, to see it happen, to see that special fucking moment, right, where you got this like 10,000 meter race, Somebody just walks away like it's their fucking moment. You know, no one is going to catch this girl. She's she is just she's fucking gone. 
And everybody in the stadium is watching this something very special happen. Why? Because we all understand athletic endeavor. We all do. I think we all, you know, that's why sports is, why people like to watch athletic sports. It's not for the blood and guts. Football, we've pretty much made as, you know, unmanly as possible in some ways compared to early football, right? Where they just had a leather helmet and shit, gouging each other's eyes out because you had no mask. (laughs) The athletic endeavor, we all recognize it when that special something happens. You know what I mean? It's nice to be part of that too. All right, that was an answer to a question. What do I like about sports? It's the, it's the athletic endeavor. It doesn't matter what's... So I like all kinds of sports. I've participated in all kinds of sports. I like motor sports, to tell you the truth, more than I like athletic sports. I would just happen to be really fucking good at baseball because that's what I did my whole life. Yeah, that's how you get good. You know what I mean? I grew up in baseball town, USA. How can you not fucking play baseball? So, huh. yeah, that special thing. You get about two or three per game now, I guess, maybe, right? What do you think? We get about two or three of these special moments per game, and then the rest of it is just professional grind. And you want to see a game with no penalties, Uh you get the games of 10 or 12 penalties, you know, it's a nice clean game, 60 minutes of football, everyone doing their job. I like a high scoring game. I want each team to score at least 21 points. You know what I mean? Uh, because it's my belief that no matter how good a defense you have, if you have a good offense, that you should be able to score a minimum of 21 points a game. A minimum. 21 points a game that they can't stop you if they had two more men I could say okay well you can stop us every play but if you have a quarterback that's capable of hitting good receivers right and you have good tight ends and you have a good running back you should be able to score 21 points a game period if you're going to play at the highest level that's that's my feelings period My boys aren't doing so good. 